Ladies and gentlemen of the American Jury and Bulldog Nation, it is time for my top five list today, which is my five favorite soft drinks of all time. It's soft drinks. It's not pop, you Southerners. By the way, I understand pop. Number five on my list. I love cherry and vanilla Coke. It can be cherry or vanilla, I don't care. And by the way, I was one of those people that got pissed off at Frisch's when they took Coke away. Give me cherry and vanilla Coke, I love those. Number four all time on my list, Stewart's Orange Drink. By the way, I like all the Stewart's products, but I particularly like their Stewart's Orange Drink. Go down nice and cold, it tastes like a creamsicle. Number three, all time on my favorite drink list, drink list, soft drink list, Frosty Root Beer. Frosty Root Beer. Frosty Root Beer. There's nothing finer than a glass of Frosty I love the bottle. I love the taste. In fact, I love most root beer. I like Barks Root Beer. I like A&W Root Beer. I love root beer, but Frosty Root Beer is number three. Number two on my all time list, Mountain Dew. Yahoo! Mountain Dew! I started drinking Mountain Dew when it first hit big. Those Yahoo! Mountain Dew, the little hillbilly on it. Then it got really cool. But Mountain Dew goes down smoother than any drink. It gives you lots of juice. I love Mountain Dew. I buy a little mini Mountain Dew so I don't drink a whole one. But Mountain Dew, I love it. Mellow Yellow cannot compare to Mountain Dew. Not even close. And number one, my all-time favorite soft drink, Bark's Cream Soda. Stop, refresh with Bark, the soft drink that's the best. Stop, refresh with Bark, flavors filled with death. I drank this as a kid. We used to put it with ice cream. And then I used to get them at the Kitten County Fair. The Kitten County Fair always had cream soda. I used to drink those suckers one after the other. But cream soda, Bark's cream soda, is my favorite soft drink of all time. Some things I left off, I like Dr. Pepper, I like ginger ale, but let's see what Roger thinks about my list. Roger, what do you think about these sugary drinks? Uh, By the way, I hate all diet aftertaste drinks. Well, because I'm doing the keto thing, I'm doing diet right now, but uh, I'm with you. Now, here, let me do some replacements of my favorites. I'm not a Mountain Dew guy. Just something about the uh, just the look of it. I never could get into it in high school. So let me take number two. I used to drink four Mountain Dews a day. Go ahead. Eel eight one. They're all right. Oh man, that's a Kentucky fave. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's my, just crisp. my wife, my wife and uh, sons like. It. I love it. And uh, you know what's funny is it's really called a late one. So, but it's Ale eight one, a late one. Uh, trivia question. When you put ice cream in the Barks Cream Soda, what is the name of that beverage? Come on. A float. No, no, no. Come on. Uncle Al days. I forget. Pink Cow. A Pink Cow, Remember yes. the Pink Cow? I remember Pink Cow, Stewart's yes. Orange, I'm on board with you. If you really, uh, Frosties, but you and I need to do a road trip. Homemade root beer in the Tri-State. The root beer stand in Sharonville. It would have to be a short road trip. Oh, come on, Eric. I mean, you... <laughs> Give me some of give me some of your love, but I but but I want I want to tell you I like Sprite, I like Seven Up, uh, I like ginger, I like all kinds of soft drinks, but none can compare to these five. I, I tell you what, I tried the uh, Coke with coffee yesterday. Ah. It ain't good. I'm a coffee drinker, but don't mix Coke and coffee. It I just, agree. No, not good at all. Um, but the so uh, if you were stuck on an island and you could only drink one soft drink for the rest of your life, what would it be? LA. All right. All right, Raj. Thank you. I promise to take a short road trip with you. This is the Bulldog. (laughs) Every dog has their day. Have a great day.